trying to see if this thing is working at all. My microphone. Hey, hey, y'all. So I have decided that I'm going to start my exploration year. And for me, what that means is I'm just going to start trying new things, exploring different places, exploring foods, exploring um, new ways of taking care of myself, exploring new ways of self-care, exploring new ways of connecting with people, just all kind of things. So it's not just about this year, it's about the rest of my life, right? Because I'm over 50 and being over 50 means that I'm mostly focused on how much longer that I have. And I think that happens to a lot of people when they hit a certain age that they start thinking about, okay, let me do some of the things that I've always wanted to do. And with that being said, I am preparing for my first trip to another continent. Yay! Uh, my, my plan and my hope is to be able to travel two continents in this year, and that is Europe and Africa. And now if anything happens, um, where I get to travel another continent in this year, I'm all here for it, right? So I'm gonna be trying to do a new thing, um, and that's vlogging on a regular basis. And I haven't did a lot of this in a while. I used to be um, real active doing things on YouTube, and um, I fell off of doing I fell off doing that because of many many reasons and I think I just really lost interest and um, so but now that I'm doing these new things and I've been watching so many YouTube videos um, for solo travel because um, some of my traveling is going to be primarily solo travel because in my community meaning my family my friends I don't have a lot of people that can just pick up and go like me um, because I have my own practice and because I have my own practice, I get to basically um, work from anywhere because um, I'm a mental health therapist and that means I see people mostly through telehealth, which is through video or on the phone and things like that. So I can move about a lot easier and I'm a lot more flexible to be able to do that. So I hope that anybody that is watching this um, decides to tag along and see some of the things that I'm doing. And today is just day two of me starting this vlogging thing. And so um, this little vlog day is just really short, really quick, just kind of introducing, reintroducing myself on to YouTube about what it is that I'm doing. So maybe you'll stick around and come back and see, and hopefully I'll be consistent with doing this, you know, because I have a podcast also, and um, on my podcast, I used to be consistent doing a new episode every week, and now I'm not. It's almost like for me that it's just differences in what it is that I want to do. There's a lot of different things that I want to do. It's a, so much that I've learned in this past couple of years since the pandemic happened and all of that. So my mindset is so different when I think about life and think about connections and think about relationships and thinking about the world in itself. So I just realized I changed my mind a lot. And that's okay, because I can, right? And um, I just see things a lot differently now. So I'm hoping that I will be able to connect a little bit more with people out there. Um, and my first continent travel is in March, the early part of March. And so I'll be seeing London, Paris, and Rome. And I'm going to bring y'all along as much as I can remember to do it. And um, yeah, see what this new exploration list gives me. And that's what I'm calling my exploration list. Some people call it a, call them bucket list and things like that. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not getting name mines <laughs> a bucket list. I'm naming it 
an exploration list. I'm exploring everything, especially food. <laughs> yes, because um, I've actually started trying to eat a little healthier and adding more things into my food, um, into my diet. And I don't claim to be anything like a vegetarian or pescatarian or vegan or anything like that, but I'm definitely exploring more meals that are vegan-like or vegetarian-like um, because I wanna get more vegetables in my diet and more plant-based food in my diet um, without claiming to be any one particular um, for that purpose. Yeah, so I don't wanna make this long. I just wanted to come in here and just kinda reintroduce myself and tell you what I'm doing and maybe you'll tag along. I'm about to head out and go to the bookstore, Barnes and Nobles. I picked the strange time to decide to go and get this book that I'm going to get because the Ravens are playing in about 15 minutes, so I need to hurry it up, get there and get back. And I'm done. I did all of that rushing only to realize the game doesn't start until 8.15 p.m. <laughs> so part of my exploration list is exploring new books to read. And so my first book I got today at Barnes and Nobles when I went was The Alchemist. I have no idea what it's about. I don't even know what genre it is. I just decided I'm gonna start somewhere and I'd be interested in a book that you might suggest. So if you're one of those people that is like really a big reader and just love reading books, give me some suggestions out there in the comments. I would love to just explore them, but I'm gonna try to do at least one book a, a, a week if it takes me that long. If not, then maybe adding a few more. I still have some books that I bought a while ago that I haven't read yet. Um, so I'm gonna kind of slip those in as well. But spending some time just to read is really good for the mind. And so I'm just gonna start taking a break and stop watching TV so much and stop being on social media as much and start adding more of some reading um, in there. So yeah, that's kind of what I'm gonna be doing. All right, until the next time y'all, good mental health, good spiritual health, and as always, good physical health. Y'all take great care.